Hello and welcome to this week's See and Know. It's great that you're joining us. Um, hopefully you're here with mum or dad, maybe brothers and sisters, and possibly even grandma and grandpa. Um, I hope that you have had a great weekend and that you're looking forward to today's story, Unconditional Love. But before we find out a little bit more about that, let's sing our welcome song and find out who's here. So we'll sing it and I'll leave a nice big gap for you or maybe mum or dad to say your name at home. Are you ready? Let's sing. Where is, where is, did you come, did you come, come to see and know? There you are, hello and welcome to see and know. Now, do you like cookies? I have to say I love cookies and Flo likes cookies too. And this week she was given two cookies, but do you know what happened? She took two more, even though she wasn't supposed to. That's quite a mistake to make, isn't it? Now, I'm sure that I have taken more cookies than I should at some point as well. But do you know what? I have forgiven Flo and it didn't change how much I loved her at all because we all make mistakes, but we're still able to be loved. And we're going to find out about God's love in our story today. So we'll do as normal, we'll practice our actions, then we'll tell the story through once, and then we'll tell it through a second time just to remind ourselves what's happened. So our actions this week, we're going to have a happy face. Big smiles. And then our second action is a sad face. Oh dear. And then we're gonna fold our arms and look really proud. We've done something really good. And then we're gonna blow a raspberry. And then we're gonna shout, hooray! Fantastic. So there are actions for today's story. So let's tell unconditional love. After Jesus had gone back to heaven, a man called Paul wrote to people and told them about God and how he loved them. He said that God loves us when we're happy. Big smiles. And he said God loves us when we're feeling sad. Oh no. God loves us when we're good. Oh look at that. But he also loves us when we're not so good. Big raspberries. <laughs> God loves us just as we are and he sent Jesus to show us how to live. Hooray! That's the story of unconditional love. Shall we tell it again to remind ourselves what's happened? So, after Jesus had gone back to heaven, a man called Paul wrote to people to tell them about God and how he loved them. He said that God loves us when we're happy. Big smiles. And he said that God loves us when we're feeling sad. <laughs> oh no. God loves us when we're good and we've done something amazing. But he also loves us when we've made mistakes and we're not so good. <laughs> God loves us just as we are. And God sent Jesus to show us how to live. Hooray! Fantastic. And that's the story of unconditional love. God loves us even when we make mistakes. And we can say sorry to him and he forgives us. He loves us when we're happy, when we're sad, when we're having a great time and when we're feeling a bit miserable as well. And when we do the right thing and when we make wrong choices. And I think that's amazing. Um, I think that's fantastic and I bet our parents love us like that as well. Now, uh, some suggestions for crafts this week. We've got some uh, pipe cleaner painting you could do or if you haven't got any pipe cleaners you could try some finger painting with some heart silhouettes or if you've got some tissue paper you could even try some sun heart light catchers. Um, and they can go in your window and look really beautiful and colourful. But funnily enough, they're all to do with love this week. And our song is going to be about love as well. And it's called Jesus Loves Me, This I Know. So shall we sing it? We'll sing it through twice. So are you ready? Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, 
They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Fantastic. Well, we're going to finish as usual with our prayer. So we're going to need our wiggly fingers. Are you ready? Let's wiggle our fingers up to the ceiling and wiggle our fingers down to the ground. Wiggle our fingers up to the ceiling and wiggle our fingers down to the ground. We open and shut them. Open and shut them. Give a little clap. Open and shut them. Open and shut them. Put them on your lap. We put one little hand over one little eye. The other little hand over the other little eye. Bow our little heads and say a little prayer. Talk to God. Dear God, we thank you that you love us so much. No matter what's happening, whether it's good or bad, whether we're happy or sad, whether we do the right thing or make mistakes, you love us all the same. And we think that's pretty amazing. And we ask you to help us love our family and our friends just as you love us. Amen. Well, I hope you have enjoyed this morning's story and our see and know session today. And we've got our sing along on Friday at 11 and we've got our one service all age worship on Sunday. So hopefully we'll see you there. But if not, we're back at see and know next Tuesday. So have a great week. Bye.